Okay, so definitely having manic symptoms. I went off on a 20 minute tangent in my head. I'm really glad nobody was here because, because somebody did something that to me was thoughtless and insensitive and you know how people in my home treat me like I don't matter and then I talked myself down and when it's not a big deal you're freaking out over nothing and this is clearly like that that manic monster in your head that loses its shit over something completely insignificant but I was literally like in a rage for 20 minutes at least probably closer to 30 and it's not quite noon and I already had a beer and I'm done <laughs> I need to chill that's what I need I need to chill I've already talked myself out of my moment of crazy and I think I'm gonna color while I wait for things to settle um, it's my daughter's 21st birthday um, so I'm making her cake which I love to do and I pre-made icing and stuff last night so that I wouldn't be stressed out and trying to get it done by a specific time tonight it would already be halfway done and it's gonna be fine and it's not a big deal and I just need to keep reminding myself it's not a big deal you're freaking out over nothing and probably gonna be upping your meds in a couple days and clearly that probably needs to happen right now so yeah I'm good now uh, I just I hate this I hate it when my mood becomes unstable because you know I, I, I feel like it's my fault somehow like I didn't you know as if I can control my brain chemistry you know what I mean it, it's it's crazy but you know I guess and I think we all do it like oh if I do the right things if I stick to a schedule if I go to sleep at a certain time if I wake up at a certain time then it's gonna be perfect and fine and that's not how mental illness works um, sometimes you can do all of the right things I take my meds at the same time every day I, I do the things my doctors tell me to do I do the things that I know work for me because I've lived with this since I was 13 years old um, and had to learn how to manage a lot of it without meds for quite a while because my parents wouldn't give me meds um, and then when I was 18 I didn't have insurance and frankly I had been without meds and therapy for so long it didn't even occur to me that I should go do that um, yeah so um, I'm gonna color and then I'm gonna make my daughter's cake and it's gonna be amazing and fine and she's going to have a lovely birthday and I'm going to have a a peaceful calm rest of the day as much as I possibly can um, that's all <laughs>